Agnes and so we are Lord 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 in praises. And we spoke about Paul and Silas connecting to God through praises in that prison yard. And so we Paul and Silas and we are going to be able to get out of the way. And things began to happen. And we are going to be able to get out of the way. That is awesome power in praises. Right there where you are now. With a very loud voice. Take any song of praises. And sing it loud and clear to the king of kings. Any song of praises. Just sing it loud and clear. If he said we can call the work. The word should be praised. The word should be praised. I will be you are worthy. Amen. Ah, me. What is the second power to connect to? In Agbara, Kijira, also Pomo. Power of prayer. Agbara, Adura. And I said to you that unlike other years, we suffer for you. I want to mirror, Lord. This year, or do you? We pray the Anna kind of prayer. Oh, yeah, God, Badura, be Anna. Pray the Jesus kind of prayer. Badura, Ruti, Jesus. Pray the Elijah kind of prayer. Badura, Adura, Tey, Elijah. We pray all manners of prayers. Badoni, Ruru, and Wan, Adura. As we are being taught in our Sunday school, we are to call one. We are only a call joy. What's the third prayer? Can you Agbara get that? The third point. What third power? Coco. Power of what? Agreement. Agbara, if you must show come. If two of you shall agree, to imagine, you know, you have a phone. Touching anything on earth, need to come glory. Lay a yee, it shall be done. I'll see. It's a one we chase one thousand. Only in your con, you'll lay a bit room. You will have expected two to chase two thousand. Ah, but you're ready to go. You made you my lay a bit room. Made you, but you said two shall chase ten thousand. Only should go. You made you your lay a bit room. There is power in agreement. Agbara, one, you know, fifty must show come. That's why I agree with you here today. Tori, the end must show fifty must show come. That you shall laugh last over your enemies. Hey, one, you're very kind. Glory, I want to hear. Let your amen roar like thunder. What is number four? Kini Kerry. Power of sowing. Agbara Fifunrukmi. You can see what has been happening to those who did first fruit offering now. Ele ori onto insele si an onto mu eso ore eso kini won wa ni si. But let me tell you one secret. E wa je nso asiri kan fun. You haven't had much yet. E o ti gbo nkan kan rara. What God is building up for some people. Oh, until all our own coat job for fun and winning. By the time they enter into it, they bat on bar wine or hello. Those who saw them yesterday, I want to ring one lad now. Will not believe that the same person. Oh, they bat go put on one lad in front. So anyone who sows eventually will reap. And it will be fun with me. Daddy, daddy, you curry. What is number five? Kini karun. Prophecy is so telling. Prophecy. It's miracle in advance. It's so tell and say, "Yano to one charge you." And so I prophesy upon your life. Tori no mo so tell the sinu aye. What has taken many people years to achieve? Fe on to ba si yori to ba mo yon lopo lopo. You will achieve it in weeks. In the name of Jesus. Yeah, you do. What's number six? Kini kefa. Power of decree. Agbara she. And there's a difference between decree and prophecy. Fe yato wa la ni so tell ya ti ashe. Prophecy to be fulfilled sometimes requires faith on the part of the receiver. Lati mu iso tele se ipa wa ti eni to ba lati ko. But a decree does not rely on that. Shuba ashe wa yiku beke le eni keni ra. When God moves to the level of decree, the decree is not dependent on whether you believe or you don't believe. Yolo rumba de ipele ipa ashe koni se bo yoga ba ta bo ba ba. And therefore, I decree upon your life. Tori no mo pa she si ori arey ayere. That your life shall arise and shine. We are here. You are today. You are sitting in Mole. In the name of Jesus. Ni oru ko Jesus. Number seven. Ikej. Power of blessings. Agbara si suri. As power in saying, I bless you in the name of the Lord. Bayo ke mo suri fun ni oru ko luwa. Mo suri fun ni oru ko luwa. And I made a small correction that day. Mo si she ah tu she di e ni ojo i. And anybody wants to greet you. Be ni kani to ba fe kini. And he says bless you. So zako e buku ni fun i. Say no. Eni rara. You should say it properly. O so da da. Let him tell you what we bless you. E di e ko so nti yo buku fun i. God bless you. O Lord yo buku fun i. The Lord bless you. O luwa yo buku fun i. We understand that one. Wa ilile ilu yiwa. Power in blessing. Agbara wa ni si suri. Blessed that day, blessed that day, blessed that day, blessed that day. Plenty of them in scripture. Allah buku fun ni wo, Allah buku fun ni wo, Allah buku fun ni wo. O ko be ni ni we mimo. Eight. Ikejo. Power of deliverance. Agbara e to sile. A lot of people who need deliverance may not even know that they need them. Awo e ko lo ko ton ni lo e to sile. Gon le mama ko mo ni lo e to sile. A man is three in one. E ni yon. A man is a spirit. Living in a body. Having a soul. 
okan any of those three parts of your life iyi ko won iyi yo won ninu apele meta aye re yi me need deliverance o le ni lo itusile the spirit may be caged e mi le wa ni ahamo and the body and soul the body and soul they are okay ki agwara ati okan kon si wa la la fear the body can be caged agwara le wa ninu ahamo the spirit and soul are not okay e mi ati okan le ma won ni ala fear any of those three iyi yo won ninu awon meteta yi may be caged lo le wa ninu ahamo the deliverance will be necessary yes wa ni lo itusile what's number nine ki ni kesan the midnight prayers agbara adura ogun ju oru that's power in midnight prayers agbara wa ninu adura ogun ju number ten ke wa power of faith agbara igbagbo for it is written without faith it's impossible to please god ati ko pe lai si igbagbo ko se se lati won olorun that come to god must believe that he is and is a reward of them that diligently seek him ati pe eni keni to ba to olorun wa ko le se igba ko nbe ati ohun lo lo se san fa won to ba fara bale wa 11 ikokan la power of fasting agbara awe 12 ikeji la power of holiness agbara iwa mimo and 13 iketa la power of discernment agbara mimo emi yato and i think that's where we stopped iro kan mo ni pe ibi ta menu dudori the power of discernment agbara imo emi yato that's what we did with last week o la menu kan ni ose to koja we prayed about on the following wednesday o la se gbadura le lori ninu wednesday to tele i pray that the power to discern mo gbadura pe agbara lati memi yato will come upon your life in the name of jesus yo pale aye re ni oruko jesus Number fourteen, power. Ikeri la akbara keri la. That you must connect to this year. Eto yeka aswara wa komoni inuwa dui. Is the baptism of fire. Oni baptisi ti no connect to divine fire. Kaso komoni no to ti okiorua. Baptism of fire. The baptisi ti no. In Luke chapter three. Nini we Luke ori keta verse sixteen. Ese keri dini ogun. Luke chapter three. We Luke ori keta verse sixteen. Ese keri dini ogun. If you are there say yes. You are about to see can we pay bail? Are you there? You are to see. Okay, I wait for you for another. What they said road in there by it is so to wait. You will look or read it at 16. Ese kan ni ni ogun. Are you there now? She are to see ni sin. John answered. Joanna down. Sin unto them all. O si we fun gbogbo won pe. I indeed baptize you with water lo to le mi nfi o mi baptize yin but one mightier than i commit to be ni ti o lagbara ju mi lo nbo the lashet of whose shoes i'm not worthy to unloose o kun ba te se ni ti emi koto he shall baptize you ohun ni yo fi which two things pelu kan meji with the holy ghost e mi mimo and with fire ati ina with the holy ghost we are baptized in pelu emi mimo and with fire ati pelu ina it didn't say he will baptize you o so pe you baptize yin with the holy ghost fire pelu ina emi mimo no rather he will baptize you ohun ni you baptize yin with the holy ghost pelu emi mimo with fire ati pelu ina there you see Three baptisms listed in this Luke 3:16. Ni la ti ri orisi baptism meta ti akoni nu we Luke ori kete seke ni dinu. Baptism with water. The baptism pe lu ino. Baptism with the Holy Ghost. The baptism pe lu e memimo. And baptism with fire. Ati baptism pe lu ino. More than at any other time in the history of mankind. Ju igba ki igba ni nu iron iton iron mo eniyo. Believers need. to be baptized with fire o ye ki awon ni gbagbo ni baptisity e mimi mo ti ina baptism of fire e baptisity ina a person who has received the baptism of fire eni na to ti gba e baptisity ina is a different human being entirely eniyan to yato patapata lo je this is beyond the level of just speaking in tongues ele ta yo ipele ke eyan kan ma fi ede fo is beyond the level of just praying and praying and praying o ta yo ke eyan kan ma gbadura ko tun ma gbadura The Bible says, "Be belly we pray, touch not my anointed." E ma se fowo kun eni ami oruro mi. Do my prophets no harm. Ke e ma se si awon wo le mi ni ibi. He makes it specific. O ji so ni pato. Don't touch them. E ma fowo kun won. Don't harm them. E ma pa won lara. If you decide to go and touch them, se wa pinu lati wa fi owo kun won. Or harm them. Tabi lati se won le se fire o bon idna yo jo in some 104 ninu ore dafidikerin le le ogorun was 4 ese kerin 
104 verse 4 Psalm 104 verse 4 says Who maketh his angels spirits His ministers what? A flaming fire. He maketh his angels what? Spirits. He maketh his ministers a flaming fire. And let me be honest with you. If you receive the baptism of fire, there are certain level of oppression that don't move close to you at all. Only a crazy mosquito or a crazy lizard will see you plugging your iron into electricity and the surface is red hot and they want to go and play there. But when you are Pressing me down on my bed. Because there is no fire. It's 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 because there is no fire. They're cursing me. They don't get me for me. And what they are saying is coming to pass. Oh, don't see we see she say you lies. There is no fire. It only people could see none. Oh, they are guarding against me. Oh, courage up on it only me. And what they are saying? Oh, two one one week is happening. Oh, she. It's because there is no fire. It only people could see none. Say behold. Someone is coming after me. The lashet of whose shoes I'm on feet on loose. Although I am baptized with water. But my own baptism. Now water. The baptism to me. So somebody is coming. It will baptize you with the Holy Ghost. On your feet, my baptism. And with fire. Ati pelu ino. Fire ino is powerful the movement. O lagbara ni nu yurinre. Fire ino is penetrating in power. When fire gets to a forest, fire does not discriminate. Whether it is elephant that is causing the trouble, whether it is lizard that is causing the trouble, whether it is even an ant, the fire does not care. That's why I'm praying for somebody here. The kind of fire that will make you untouchable hot coals of fire. I command it to come upon you in the name of Jesus. Oh, I see fire. 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 I fire. Is reliable. No, oh shit, back at least. Hot. Oh, bono. There is no cold fire. Oh, see, not too too. All fires are hot. But we know, look, bono. Fire does not compromise. You know, keep more jagged. Fire removes impurities. You know, I'm a more label. Remember the story of Isaiah. A roti to Isaiah. When Isaiah saw the Lord, and he said, Woe is me, for I'm undone, for I am a man of unclean lips. He saw himself straight away that he was a man of unclean lips. He knew his weakness straight away that he was a man of unclean lips. What was the solution of heaven? The solution of heaven was to take coals of fire. So hot that the angel had to use a material to hold it. Hold the fire. Isaiah. Isaiah. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Lion, you're a lion, you're a. Drop the fire on his tongue. Oh, but you, a shiny, you see a horn. Fire.
purifies. It removes impurities. Some of the message they preach, stop this, stop that, don't say that, don't do that, don't do that. People who have baptism of fire don't need such messages. They don't, but lack of that baptism of fire. Plenty of impurities in your body. And these impurities are the ladders through which the enemy come in. Fire dominates. Fire is confrontational. We need that baptism of fire today. The sign of Christianity. To be quite honest with you, it's not the cross, but the tongues of fire. The tongues of fire. You need that fire when the enemy appears to be winning. You need that fire when there's a battle going and the enemy seems to be winning you. Those of you who are into prayer and deliverance ministry and intercession. You know that when a situation becomes really hard and stubborn. The answer is fire. It's fire. I'm praying for you. That every power. That has defeated you before you got born again. Powers that have defeated you before you got born again. That is now waging war against you. Let fire destroy them this morning. In the name of Jesus. Say fire! By the power in the blood of Jesus. Amen. Amen. You need that baptism of fire. When good things disappear from you without explanation. Your possessions just start to diminish. Things are going slow. Without explanation. They're just going slow. Without explanation. I decree. At every injection of the enemy that is subtracting from you, shall backfire. In the name of Jesus, you need that baptism of fire. When the enemy is carrying out an evil broadcast against you, you need that baptism of fire. You need the baptism of fire. When the enemy puts a full stop on your moving forward. You need that baptism of fire. You need the baptism of fire. When the enemy is the traffic warden for your breakthrough. They are redirecting your breakthrough to somewhere. I declare upon somebody here. Any power pushing you to the tail region. Shall be buried in the name of Jesus. You need that fire when the enemy is converting your bucket to basket. You need that fire when the enemy wants you to go from grace to grass. You need that baptism of fire. When you receive that baptism of fire, prayer becomes pleasure. Prayer Adura. becomes a love affair between you and God. When you receive that baptism of fire, reading the Bible, 
Lati maka bibeli becomes pleasurable. Awa de won to gbadun mo yin. Because it's like you are reading a love letter from your lover. Se da le npe en ka letter ife lati odolufe yin. You have received that baptism of fire. Ni gba te ba ri baptism na igba. When they file your report in the covens, they will carefully warn them. Don't go there. Those who put their fire. Don't go there. Don't go there. Don't go there. One year, Lord, a lady was having trouble delivering a baby. Arab, you can need a mulati be or more bearing or more con. As the thing was getting very problematic, they remembered a sister that was living opposite the house. They remembered the sister. So someone now suggested, let's go and call Sister Mary. Let her come and pray. Let her come and pray. As somebody mentioned, let us call Sister Mary. A demon spoke from the mouth of the woman that wants to deliver the baby. Belly, me who can't stop laughing, no brain to fair be moy. Say ah, ah. All of you did you hear? Go go in, say Bobby. They are going to call Sister Mary. Arab boy, Mary, I don't lock. Why? She's breaking fire here. Oh my, no boy. Everybody, run away, run away, run away. Go go in, sal, sal, sal. Don't wait for Mary to come here. Emma, do not take part in Mary. Are you there? It will inflict untold injuries just a mere mention let us go and invite the demons were terrified may your anointing terrify your enemies let that amen be loud and clear how many want this baptism of fire? And when you may long for a baptism, no. What can you do? One baptism of fire. Oh, that a ban for a baptism, no. You have to do away with all your sins. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, go from go go the scarcity of the power of God. Oh, one go go at bara or lorum in any generation. Nino, you run you. It's not the fault of God. It's because he can't find men and women that he can use. It's not the fault of God. It's not the fault of God. It's not the fault of God. It's not. It's not the fault of God. I'm getting unhappy day by day. That uh, the age of accurate prophetesses are disappearing. Accurate prophetesses. It's vanishing. Because. The sisters who should be interested in fire. They are more interested in fashion. And fashion carries no fire. With your fashion, you can be wasted by a small girl who has witchcraft. It's, it's, it's becoming very sad. The Little number of prophetesses that are left now. They are very old women. And it's not supposed to be so. The Bible says, Your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. Your young men shall see visions. Your old men shall dream dreams. Now is the young men who are dreaming dreams. These days, it's the young men who are dreaming dreams. That's a very sad situation. I believe the sisters should pray for revival. The brothers should pray for revival. I look forward to the day when we have prophetesses. Age 12. 13. 14. 21. Sisters were on fire. They will make a difference, a change. So the first thing, do it with yourself. Humble yourself before God. Wait on the Lord. Hunger and thirst for that fire. For more of God. The Bible says. Blessed are they who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they shall be filled. Praise the Lord. So the 14 power you should connect to is the 
baptism of fire. Oh, ni baptisiti no. Can you close your eyes where you are? Edi otu ni biti ebawa. This is for those who want the baptism. Ele ifu amo ton fe baptisi. Not for those who are just come for a service. Ese ifu amo ton kwa wafu isi sha. But if you are here, but ebawa ni, and you do not want to go on with a plastic experience. Ye o sibe kwa lole kwa lu yuri boti wape no lokpa da sile. Jesus told his disciples. Yes, so far one man here said, "Tarry ye in Jerusalem." Oni eduro ni Jerusalem until you be endowed with power. Titi a ofi fi agbara wo yin. Said, "Don't stay there." Oni eduro sibe until you be endowed with power. Titi a ofi fi agbara wo yin. When those men receive their own baptism of the Holy Ghost with fire. Ni gba ti awon ara kun ni gba e baptism ti e bi mu ati na won. When they landed on the street. Ni gba ton di awon opopo na. Jerusalem knew there was problem. Jerusalem no make we wahala de. This man who were afraid before. Awon kun ni won yin ti won je ojo tele tele. Who went to hide? Ti won lo sa pamọ. They now came out boldly. Awon na wa jade pelu ipo ya. Something entered into them. Fire has entered into their bones. E not won nu egungun won. Because I was fire in their bones. E so di pe e not won nu egungun won. They came out and began to talk boldly. Won did they also feel igbo ya soro. They locked them up. Won ti won mo le. They just opened the door and threw them out again. Angel e si ile ko fun won to mu wa jade. They were arrested. Won lo si bi ton ti mu won tele tele. Want to bear it? There was fire in their bones. In no one, in no even going on. Fire was burning there. In on Johnny Benny. And because of that, they told the day they had a testimony. Oh, Larry, they said this man. Only I want to know. They have turned the world. What is so upside down? Bogbaye Kodo. This man. I want to know. They turned the world. What is so Bogbaye upside down? What is so Kodo? With your hand raised up high, you will shout this. Not that anyone around you. Join, can you walk here? Bye. Okay, be ready. Don't worry. What is happening around you? Emasi bikita ni ponto nse. That person is receiving his breakthrough and is going away. Eri yele Maria la jare ba o singu be a la jare lo. I pray. Baba mo badu. As many people as will call for that fire this morning. Pe ya wansi o cake pe no eni o uroi. That the liquid fire of the Holy Ghost. Pe no gidi ti o mimimo. We go from the top of their head to the sole of their feet. Yo lo la ti ani ori o lo di. In the name of Jesus, you will shout that fire seven times. Eh, okay, be no any damage. And you will say, incubate my life. Eh, what's up with she? Do I hear? It is already hanging here. Oh, it is so rusty. It's for you to pull it down upon your head. Oh, I could see people fast. You realize? The louder you shout your fire, the better. Be a win. No, it is so okay to be. You are the darasi. Makapoli, apoli, terabosi. Open your mouth and shout it now. Yes, Ben. That's right. Oh, that Ben. That's right. That's right. Oh, that Ben. He commands my life now. In the name of Jesus. Me or you, God, yes. That's a fire. No, no, no. Yes, Ben. Somebody is breaking through. Somebody is breaking through. In Jesus' name we pray. We are just warming up. Just warming up. Just Get yourself ready again. Sister, get yourself ready. This is why Jesus brought you here. Something is about to happen to you now. That will change your life completely. Seven fold again. Let your voice roll like thunder. Let's go. One, two, three. Six, seven. He commands my life now. In the name of Jesus. You are It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. Oh, sell it. Oh, sell it. Open that mouth. Open that mouth. That's why you are here. Let me hear you. Tori mo lese wali. In Jesus name we pray. Ne oruko Jesus na badu. Ben. Silence. 
Idakeje. I'm going to count seven from this altar. Lati bi pepe ni o ti ka unka deje. When I mention the number seven, ti ba menu ko unka eje. There are some people here. Awo ni o ko wani. Certain things in your life. Awo unko ko ni pa to di nuaye. I'm contesting with that fire. Won fi gada ga pelu ino i. When I mention seven, ti ba menu ko eje. A bombardment of volcanic fire will fall upon you. Ayalu ino yo balei. And your life will change completely. I hear you. Yes, you pata pata pata. One, any, two, a g, three, eta, four, a ring, five, a room, six, five, seven, a j. Benny. Whatsoever is lodging in your body oh, come on, don't fear God. That, that is contrary to the power of God The fire is burning The fire is burning The fire is burning From the top of the head to the sole of the feet from the top of the head to the sole of the feet from the top of the head to the sole of the feet from the top of the head to the sole of the feet from the top of the head to the sole of the feet from the top of the head to the sole of the feet from the Amen. Ah, me. With a loud voice, sing this song. Sing it loud. Keep your eyes closed as you sing this song. Look towards heaven as you sing this song. Keep your eyes closed. Look towards heaven as you sing that song. Get a separate. Get a separate. Get a separate. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I want the fire that is fresh. I want the fire that is fresh. Oh, fire cannot do. I want the fire that is that is fresh. I want the fire that is fresh. I want the fire that is fresh. Oh, fire cannot do. I want the fire that is fresh. That is fresh. I want the Close your eyes as you sing. That is fresh. I want the fire that is fresh. That is fresh. What fire cannot do me? I want the fire that is fresh. That is fresh. I want the fire that is fresh. That is fresh. I want the fire that is fresh. That is fresh. What fire cannot do me? Fresh, 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 fresh. Thank you, Jesus. I soon this. Amen. Amen. The fifteenth power. Agbara ke dogun. To learn to connect to this particular year. It's the anati soko money no doing ni pata. Is the court of God. Oni. The court of God. Open olorun. The court of God. Ile ejo olorun. The fifteen power to connect to. Ti eba farabale lati suara yipo mo. 
In 1 Kings chapter 22, verse 19, First Kings twenty-two nineteen. And he said, Hear thou therefore the word of the Lord. I saw the Lord sitting on his throne. And all the hosts of heaven standing by him on his right hand and on his left. And the Lord said, Who shall persuade Ahab that he might go up and fall at Ramoth Gilead. And one said on this manner, another said on that manner. And there came forth a spirit and stood before the Lord and said, I will persuade him. And the Lord said unto him, Behold, I will persuade him. Wherewith? Well and he said, I will go forth. And I will be a lying spirit in the mouth of all his prophets. And he said, Thou shalt persuade him and prevail also. Go forth and do so. Here was a court of the Almighty. The case of Ahab had been taken to that court. And the court of the Almighty had issued the judgment. That persuade this man to go and destroy himself. One weapon you must connect to this here is the weapon of God's court. Connect yourself to the weapon of God's There court. is something known as the courtroom of the Almighty. Something is known as the courtroom of the Almighty. No befalls any enemy that is dragged to this court. I see people here this morning who need to drag certain enemies to that court. Because no before any enemy that you report their case to the court of heaven. Those kind of enemies, they will become enemies of themselves. They will begin to fight and oppose themselves. When their case is taken to that court, they sink in their Red Sea the way Pharaoh sank in the Red Sea. When a case is taken to that court of heaven, the enemy is seeking for compulsory barrier like Kora, Datan, and Abiram. That kind of enemy is seeking for stones of fire after the order of Goliath. The enemy that you drag to the court of the Almighty is looking for a bombardment of bad luck. The enemy you drag to that court, they are going to obtain certificate of occupancy in the desert. You see, the final supreme an absolute judge over all creation is the Almighty. And one powerful weapon of warfare is to drag the enemy to God's court. A time will certainly arrive in your life if it has not arrived now. When you will have to go to this courtroom and bring their case to God. You come to that courtroom and ask God to render judgment against your adversaries. Remember the story of that widow in Luke chapter 18 who kept going to that judge avenge me of my adversaries avenge me of my adversaries avenge me of my adversaries read the book of Psalms well see how many times the psalmist refers to God as a judge 
I pray that the power to connect to that courtroom of God will come upon you in the name of Jesus. Let us amen be loud and clear. But there's a snag. There's a small problem. The problem is this. You do not go before any judge or any courtroom in a disorganized state. Certainly, you don't go before a judge. Hey, Oli, Lossi, what do I do? Ah, oh, I hear this in my head. Yes, why am I here? I need to, I need to one here in this case. Thank you. Ah, I'm a dad. Look around. Any what you hear? See you. Hello, dear. You can't do that. Hey, Oli, see you. You can't come before the court. Hey, Oli, what do I do? What do I do? And you are bringing disorganized presentation. Yes, why am I here? You want me or not? You need to, you know. You must be spiritually orderly. Ne party e mi e lati di ento leto. There are steps for you to get a hearing in God's courtroom. You must ensure that your own life is fully yielded to God. So that you don't get to that courtroom and you talk and the enemy stands up and says, Sir, you can't listen to what this one is saying. This one is a fornicator. This one is a liar. This one steals. This one drinks. He has no local standing here. He can't stand there. So remove this. We can't listen to this one. You can't come to that courtroom. And the enemy says, ah. You can't. Uh, enemy says, you can God, you can't answer this man. You can't answer this man. Because it is written. Let not your heart be troubled. Believe in God. And believe in me also. So, look, look at the heart of the man coming to court. His heart is troubled. So the enemy knocks you out. By the law. Which is the Bible. So ensure that your life is fully yielded to God. Give up all your sins. Carry out a thorough cleansing of your life. To ensure that the devil had no legal stand. No legal claim. Then you now organize your petition. In a logical manner. One way to do that is to write it down. What you want to take to that courtroom. Write it down. This is where I'm working. This is what is happening. This is what social person is doing. This is where my children are working. This is what the man is saying. Write it in all daily way like that. And you hold that petition in your hand. And come to that courtroom by the blood of Jesus. When you want to start the prayer, say, Father, I approach your courtroom now by the blood of Jesus. Request to come before the judge of the whole earth. Ask the Holy Spirit to help your case. Say, Father, register me in that court now. Let my case be given divine preference. Then you cannot begin to drag the enemy one by one. One by one. To the courtroom. And if you like, you can ask heaven to put a restraining order on those things that the enemy is doing. This is how to hand over your battles to God. By connecting to the courtroom of the Almighty. And like I told you, woe befalls any enemy that is dragged to that courtroom of the Almighty.
This is why we are going to stop this morning. That will continue next time. Rise up on your feet now. Rise your feet, beloved. And all eyes closed. Jesus is here. Jesus and he has an agenda for our lives. An agenda for our spirits. He has a program for our destiny. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Can you shout this loud and clear now? My father! My father! My father! Baba, arise in the thunder of your power. Show me a sign for good. Fi mi My father. Baba me. Arise in the thunder of your power. Today Show me a sign for good. Fi mi In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and decree that one. El ibi ke paseli. Show me a sign for good. Fi ami kono me furere. Amen. Amen. There are some people in this meeting today having all kinds of oppression of the enemy. But the Bible says, oppression shall be far from you. Someone is here. You don't eat. No food. But you have no feeling of hunger. And you are losing your weight. Get yourself ready. The hand of God is about to touch you. And someone here, the spirit of death and hell has been pursuing you. And someone here too, they are having breathing difficulties. And someone here, you are perceiving these strange odors around you. And someone here, even in this trip, in this week that went by, there were occasions where you felt like pulling off your clothes. The power of God is about to begin to move from person to person. Hear the footsteps of Jesus. He is now a Simba, bearing back for the wounded, even all who apply. As he speaks to the sufferer, who lay at the pool, he says, In this moment, will now be made whole. Will be made whole. Will thou be made whole? Oh, come, we suffer. Oh, come, sin, sin, so. See the cleansing with joy. See the cleansing with Lord. Step into the current and
In the head, in the eyes, in the womb, in the legs, you are the, 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 the spirit of oppression. In the head, in the eyes, in the womb, in any part of the body. I bind you and I cast you out. In the name of Jesus. 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 Everything you have eaten or swallowed, physically or spiritually, that is troubling your health now. I bind them and I cast them out in the name of Jesus. Receive the touch of Jesus. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. Receive it. In the name of Jesus. That's right. Every swelling under the armpit. Every pain in the liver. Pain in the kidney. Every trouble in the back room. Trouble in the leg. Trouble with the, the leg. Yes. I will bind you and I cast you out in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing now. Aha. Ben. Now check your body. Begin to do what you could not do before. You cannot bend, bend. You cannot use your leg, use your leg. You cannot see, see. You cannot hear, hear. Now the power of God is coming upon you. That's right. That's right. Do what you could not do before. Once you find that the Lord has healed you, don't hide. Run quickly to the altar here. Don't let the devil put it back. The power of God is moving. The fire of God is moving. Just check your body. That's right. You have been healed. Run quickly to the altar here. No matter where you are, we shall wait for you. Just run here quickly. Don't let the devil put it back on you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Stretch your right hand towards this altar. Father, this hands of us stretch here. Let this hand become the hand of healing. The hand of deliverance. The hand of power. The hand of strength. The hand of glory. The hand of healing. The hand that will remove every oppression. In the name of Jesus. Get us separated now. Anywhere you have pain in your body or trouble in your body, smite it aggressively. aggressively. Don't feel sorry for that place. Somebody is being ill in that gallery from a strange situation. Run in your body quickly. Don't let the devil put it back. You smite that body 21 times and shout back to the sender. Back to the sender. Let's go. Oh, yeah. One. Any. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Do it twice. Do it twice. Do it twice. Say that. Check your body now. Do what you could not do before. And run quickly to the altar here. Don't let the devil put the problem back. That's right. That's the hand of God. That's the hand of God. It's coming upon you. Check that your tummy. What is moving about there has just disappeared. Check that flow of blood. It has just vanished now. That's the power for coming upon that woman. The rope around your waist is broken. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, thank you, Jesus. 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 Right there where you are, you will shout this loud and clear. Oh, kick me alone to Jagara. Agbara, to pursue my pursuers. Let the fall upon me now. In the name of Jesus.
Jesus. Jesus. Something is happening over there. Oh, there. There's a fire of God coming upon you. No, Lord, no. But God has said, Tell you, come. Did you ever support the day of Shendera Basanta? In Jesus' name we pray. If you are that person, you were practically carried here. Something is happened to you where you are. Something has been taken out from your brain. Something has been taken out from your heart. And right there where you are, begin to do what you could not do before. And jump on your feet and run quickly to the altar here. For the hand of God has healed you. The weaknesses are gone. Yes, that's the power of God. That's the power of God. There are three prayers to pray. I do not matter this prayers are prayers that have blessed millions. People have been praying them for years. Pray them again today to give you your own breakthrough. Say, Lord, heal me and I shall be healed. Save me and I shall be saved. Bamila, Emiola. In the name of Jesus, Lord, open your mouth and pray that prayer. Heal me and I shall be healed. Save me and I shall be saved. Bamila, Emiola. What a mighty God we serve. Oh Lord, we are not dancing. Jesus name we pray. Ni oruko Jesu la gbadura. Dangerous prayers. Adura to lewi. Pray it well. Egba dada. Don't say I prayed it before. E ma ni mo ti gba ri. Owners of evil Lord. E yin to ni eru ibi. The word of the Lord. Egbo. Come your Lord. Egbi eru in the name of Jesus. Ni oruko Jesu. Command them to carry their loads. I said, Tell the Kay about Shenter Abasanta. Baria Polycatasata. Polycatasata. In Jesus' name we pray. Me, Uruko Jesu, La Badura. The Bible says, Bibeli, we pray. These are the horns. That scattered Judah. To to Judah, ka? Judah could not raise his head. Ki Judah ma ba le be ori reso ke. Can you now shout this loud and clear? Eh ale ki gbele lo wo ke bi. Any power. Agbara kagbara. That does not want me to raise my head. Ti ko fe ki gbe ori mi so ke. You are a liar. In the name of Jesus. Oh yes. Oh yes. In Jesus. Name we pray. Niuruko Jesus la badura. A major work. Has been done in a particular life. Don't be shy. Find a way to this altar. Father, Baba, we cover the signs and wonders here with the blood of Jesus. Lay your hands upon your people. Affliction will never, never rise again. Lie in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Before we take any song of praises again in your mouth, and sing it loud and clear to the King of Kings, and to the Lord of Lords. Thank you, Jesus.
In Jesus' name we pray. The Lord bless you from Zion. And make his face to shine upon you. And be gracious unto you. You will go from strength to strength. And from glory to glory. It is well with you. This week, you shall experience a marathon of favor. And wherever you go, darkness shall flee. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you for listening to us this evening. See you tomorrow in the name of Jesus.